Good morning, guys. Welcome to a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Have you guys seen that movie, um, Mr. Rogers? We haven't, uh, but I want to. So <laughs> we're in the hotel now in Virginia, Alexander, Virginia, I think. It's just over the border from Maryland. We made it here last night. When did we get here, baby? 10? 10.30, 10.40, somewhere in there. Um, we were both pretty tired. We opened up our toys that we got from Best Buy and then we crashed. So, woke up this morning. We were, Our plan was to get up at 6, go um, like shower and stuff, get ready and leave at 7. But we woke up and we were both like dead tired. So we didn't do that. We are about to head out. It's almost 9.30 and we're feeling fresh. We're feeling ready to go. And so we're going to do that. Thanks for coming along on today's Ride of Life. We've got four more states left to go. We've got North Carolina, South Carolina, Atlanta, or no, Atlanta. I keep thinking Georgia is Atlanta. Georgia, and then Florida. So big states to get through, but we will do that. Hmm? Alabama? Yeah, yeah. We'll skip Alabama because that's a little bit out of the way. So we're going to do that. Thanks for joining us today. Let's get this day on the road. Oh, and by the way, using the new EOS R, trying that today for the first time. Let me know what you think. Hopefully it's so much better. No, it's gonna be the same because it's exactly the same spec wise. We love you guys, let's go. Cool, baby? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. What's up guys? <laughs> first stop of the day and we're stopping here in Oh wait, what town was this? I said it. Something Creek. Stony Creek. Stony Creek or Stone Creek? Stone Creek, Virginia. Stone We're about Creek. half an hour from North Carolina right now. People have said once you get to the Carolinas, they go and go and go. I think my heart dropped earlier for the first time when I heard the GPS say, for the next 587 miles, continue straight. Yes. <laughs> but it is officially, oh, there you go. It was 70 degrees earlier. It's 68 now. 70 degrees feels good. It feels cool still, but... <laughs> um, yeah, so we got some food. Some Subway first food of the day, too. Oh, yeah. We are True. about... Let's see. If we were to drive with no brakes, we would be... 10 hours and 33 minutes away from our final destination, so... Getting closer, we're gonna chop it off one hour at a time and see how we feel. Um, yeah, baby, how was your nap? Good. <laughs> <laughs> she slept pretty much, the, pretty much the first two hours, so I'm glad you were able to sleep because then you can drive while I sleep. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, we're gonna get back on the road again. On the road again. All right. Um. Oh my goodness, guys, stopping for a break here in North Carolina somewhere. Not sure where exactly we are, but I think we're at least halfway through, so that's good. Um, stopping for a little stretch, use the bathroom here at a rest stop, and we're going to keep trucking. Keisha's taking over. She's going to drive. Rockstar, my babe. <laughs> And uh, I'm gonna take a nap. <laughs> I've been driving for over five hours now. Woo! Hope you guys are doing awesome. It's 75 degrees and warm, and I love it. Boom! Shakalaka! <laughs> We're almost out of Did South Carolina. Can you believe it? I think um Are we in South Carolina or North Carolina? South. Oh, I told that. 41%. Oh. Um yeah, we're almost to Georgia. I think another I don't know how long till we get there. Uh it shouldn't be too long to Savannah, Georgia. If we get through Georgia. We are going to um stay the night in Daytona Beach, Florida. So we booked a hotel right on the beach. So really pumped about that. And it'll put us only two hours from our destination, but we figured we'd spend the night, get a good night of sleep, and then just drive the two hours in the morning tomorrow and get there and relax the rest of the day. So I think that'd be good. You're so cute, baby. I love you. Okay, so we're gonna hit the road 
got about three and a half hours before we get to our hotel and we also need to get some food but we got um some ben and jerry's ice cream sandwiches and i got a red bull so excited about that well guys we are here in our hotel room and it's a residence in daytona beach right on the beach so tomorrow we'll go and we'll check out the beach and the ocean mama's ocean i'm so excited for that so there's a kitchen right here full kitchen this is actually huge baby is it huge wait where are you hi girl still focused on me um huge so in here it, you come in the door over there there's a bathroom right here come in here and there's a bedroom with two beds and we're not even gonna sleep in this room. Come in here, and there's a living area. And then a whole big bedroom here. This is the king bed we'll sleep on. And then ensuite bathroom here with a big walk-in shower. Pretty crazy, baby. Have you ever seen a hotel room this big? I don't think so. Feels kind of like an apartment, like you said earlier. Yeah. It's like huge. Anyway, we just ordered Applebee's from Uber Eats. Hopefully that goes well. And should be here by 11.45, midnight at the latest. We're starving. <laughs> so anyway, we got food and it was a long drive here. Today was a, oh, it was a late day. It was about 13 hours, but that's with the stop. So we drove about 11 hours oh, baby helped out uh, we're exhausted but we're gonna have a great evening and wait the evening's pretty much over um i guess we're gonna call it a night now instead of wait for the food to arrive so remember that the journey matters we love you guys and tune in tomorrow to see what daytona beach looks like in the day